Somebody treats me disrespectfully. Why anger? You could say, fine, I'm scared. Then why don't I just say, you know what? I'm really scared that I'm not worthy of connection. Maybe you could give me a yashakayach. Maybe you could say something nice. Now, granted, I don't want to be vulnerable because I might get rejected again. But why don't I try? What is it about anger? Why anger? Because if you understand this, you'll know that every single negative emotion feeds from a trough of anger. Lust, envy, honor, greed, whatever it is, all feed from anger. And when you own this, it is so amazingly freeing. Why do I get angry? Why? <coughs> It's obvious that we would, but why? Why don't I just, I don't know, say, you know what, it's your problem, not mine. Hmm? So, anger is the illusion of control. I feel out of control. I don't feel like I can, I, I'm in a position where I'm going to get what I want. Physiologically, what happens when a person becomes angry? Right? The brain releases a number of hormones, there's neurotransmitters, there's adrenaline, neuroadrenaline, cortisol, floods the system, it makes us feel empowered. It gives us the illusion that we are strong and we'd rather feel mad than sad. I would rather feel angry than feel afraid. So my son doesn't listen to me. My spouse doesn't respect me. I don't want to feel scared, so I get angry because it gives me the illusion that I'm actually in control. How many people walk to those you know, doors that are supposed to open up, you walk up to them and they just don't open? And the first thing you do is you look around to see if anyone saw you bang your nose into the door? I don't want to be rejected by an electric eye. Right? So anger gives us the illusion that we're in control. That's why we get angry. You've just experienced another Torah class brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.